All right, welcome back to the next lesson, CPR choking. This is just gonna be one part of, of, of choking. Um, we already kind of established already with the my obstruction, complete obstruction. We kind of talked about that. So now this is the scenario. So the scenario is we have a patient who's responsive. We're gonna have three populations, adult, child, and infant. Adult, child, and infant. Keep this as simple as, simple as possible. So we have a situation where we have a choking. All right, now this population is gonna be an adult patient. All right, so you give me the answer you think it is. Okay, I'll give you a few seconds. One, two, good. And the answer is, if the patient is responsive, not unresponsive, but responsive, and the answer is, we're gonna give abdominal thrust. Abdominal thrust. And I'm gonna show you in the next couple of videos on how to perform this skill, all right? So for choking, adult, responsive, patient, that's choking, abdominal thrust. The next one, we have the next population is a child. So a child, so a child is choking and they are responsive. If they're responsive, guess what we do? Okay, answer it before I even go and show you the answers. Give it a shot. All right, sounds good, sounds good. Here it is, ready? And boom, abdominal thrust. So you're just gonna have to adjust your height to their height and do the technique, which I will show you in the next video. But what I want you to understand today is the knowledge of choking a child, responsive abdominal thrust. And last but not least, we have our choking, responsive infant. So the infant, baby, right? So the infant here will be responsive, but they're having a severe choking. What is the technique? All right, the answer is five back slaps, but it's not over, five chest thrusts. Five back slaps, five chest thrusts. All right, so that is going to be the technique that we're gonna use on a responsive patient. I hope this helped you. We have this session. You can hit those arrows. It's supposed to hit the likes and hit the subscribe. And please share, please share this channel to others because I'll have a ton of videos on helping you in your class for EMTs. All right, have a good one until the next video.